Welcome everybody, hopefully geometry students, maybe some algebra students leaked in here to another Khan Academy tutorial. We're doing unknown angle problems with algebra. So let's go ahead and jump in. I'm gonna try to do this in under five minutes. We'll see how it goes. Couple different things here. We have two angles composing uh, a double kind of compound angle here. And you can see that it adds up to 90 degrees. So these two angles here, the blue and the green are complementary because they add up to 90. So the blue angle, Okay, plus the green angle is going to equal the red angle, which we know is 90 degrees. Okay, so now we're just going to input some values. I'm going to go switch to purple. Well, let me just go see what we have. X, we have 3X plus 10, and then we know it's going to be equal to 90, so we're going to go ahead and do that. We're going to combine like terms. We get 4X plus 10 equals 90. We subtract 10 from both sides. We have 80 equals 4x, we divide by 4, divide by 4, and we get x equals 20. There's our answer. Again, if I'm going fast, go ahead and pause, rewind, copy it down, but we're on a roll here. There's our first one down. Solve for x in the diagram below. Okay, this is another geometry concept. We have something called vertical angles. They have, uh, their, their sides are opposite rays. Okay, I like to think of it as they're across from each other and they share the same lines on both sides. So these are vertical angles, that means they are equal. So you say 120 is equal to 3x. Now it's very simple, we just divide by three, divide by three, and we get x equals 40 degrees. Okay, well it's actually 40 degrees, but the value of x is 40. I don't know why it has the degree sign there. Kind of an error on Tom Cavie's part, but anyway, next question. Okay, now we have a supplementary angle situation. This makes a straight line, this is a linear pair. So the blue angle and the green angle form a linear pair. So the blue angle, the green angle, add up to the linear pair, which is 180 degrees. That's what a straight line, uh, the, how many degrees are in a straight line? So now we can substitute the values. So we have two X plus 45 plus X, and that equals 180. Let me get my plus sign in there and my equal sign. So I'm gonna combine like terms. I get three X plus 45 equals 180. That's gonna be 135 equals, after I subtract 45 from both sides, equals three X. I think this is, what is it, 30, 45? Is it 45? 135 divided by, uh, what is it, three? I'm gonna divide by, oops, 135 divided by three. I get 45. So I divide by three, I divide by three. I get X equals 45 degrees. This time you can put x equals 45 degrees because that's one of the labeled angles. All right, next question. We have another a scenario where it's a complementary angle. We have it adds up to 90 degrees. So we're gonna say 35 plus 5x equals 90 degrees. So we just need to subtract 35 first, subtract 35. We get 5x equals 55, divided by five, divided by five, x equals 11. I think you guys are getting this by now. So then we have vertical angles here. We're gonna set them equal to each other. Purple is equal to purple. We get four X plus 50 equals 150. Minus 50, or minus five, minus, uh, oh, that is 50, isn't it? Four X plus 50, minus 50, I get 100 equals four X. What times 100 equals, oh, what times four equals 100, and that is 25. So we have 25, we have a couple more. I think I'm gonna get it under five, really pushing it. Okay, this one's a little bit more complex because we have three angles here that are gonna add up together to equal 180. You can see they all form this straight line here. So we're gonna say X plus 12 plus 100 plus X equals 180. So the first thing I would do is combine like terms. We have X plus 112 plus X equals 180. So I'm gonna do 180 minus 112, 180 minus 112, I get 68 equals 2x, divide by 2, divide by 2, I get x equals 34. And I'm down to my last question. Oh, I didn't make it quite in time for the five minutes, but hopefully this video will be short enough where you're gonna be likely to watch it. So then I have two more problems, or another complementary angle here. This one's trying to trick you, but notice that the two angles form only 90 degrees. Okay, so 90, 90 on both sides. And this one is blue. So then we have 20 plus 
6x minus 2 equals 90. Not 180, because the angles are in question are here and here. And since this is 90, this one also needs to be 90 because they're supplementary. And that is equal to 90. So we subtract. Uh, we have 22 plus 6x equals 90. 90 minus 22 equals 68 equals 6x. I divide by 6. Uh-oh, did I do this right? 20 plus 6x minus 2. So we get, oops, that's 18. So I need to do, sorry, right here. So this is 18. So I got to do 90 minus 18, sorry. And I get 72. Ha, ha, here we go. So I get 72 equals, and this is 18, minus 18, minus 18. So then 72 divided by 6, and that gives me 12. And that's my final answer. And we're done. Hopefully you'll have this much success. Hopefully that was short enough for you. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.